All right, look at that, you guys. We finally got a furnace. Okay, what can we do with this right at the moment? So it takes it takes fuel, but um, I don't know what kind of fuel it takes. It doesn't tell us. Um, but look at this. We now make actual alloys instead of just straight up stuff, which is really cool. And we can make rubber and plastic in here now, so we don't need the Kim bench for that. But this is the really cool part. Check this out. You can upgrade it. And then it'll actually start making water. I'm loving this, man. This is so much better. All right, guys. Welcome back to Osiris New Dawn Experimental Branch. I'm an old guy gaming, and uh, we are quite literally picking up right where we left off. It's only been a couple of seconds for me since I left in the last episode. Uh, we have five points here. Uh, let's put uh, a point into health, a point into strength, a point into stamina, and another point into health and strength. I'm not going to worry about the proficiencies right now. Our first thing that we have to do immediately is find something to oh. eat. So we need a red tree. Uh, we, we we can't really go down there because there's a spider that spawns. There is a red tree off in the distance, but um, let's just go this direction. Uh, because uh, a red... Oh, you know what, though? Actually, oh. hold on. We're just going to have to tough it out a little bit longer. I need to drop some things off, so hopefully we can make a couple of... Um, of the crates, the scrap crates. Uh, let's take a look at that really quick. F2. Utilities. Uh, scrap metal chest. Oh shit, we need more makeshift patch tape, even to make this, huh? Alright, um... I mean, I love it. I think that's the way it should be. I don't want things to be too easy. <gasps> Except for right at this very moment. <laughs> okay, well, we, we've got to eat first. I mean, we're just going to have to be heavy for a little bit longer. We've just got to eat. Uh, so let's find a red tree because that's really about the only source of food that we have available to us at this moment. There's just not any other, anything else that we can eat right now. That's a purple tree. Man, where the hell is the red trees at? Do we really have to go that far? Uh, I do not want to get the crab's attention that spawns down there. Let's go off this way. That's kind of the downside to the location we're currently at is there's not really a food source. There's the purple berries, but those are not as good as the red berries. Plus, we kind of we need those to make the tape stuff. It looks like a lot of things are requiring that now. Okay, so that's a purple tree. There's there's two red trees up there, so at least there's two of them. Oh, uh, shit. Okay. I don't see a red tree over here. Let's just look one last time before we go further. Yeah, that's a purple tree, purple tree. Goodness gracious. Okay, I guess we're going to have to hike over to this red tree. If I have to take another bandage in between uh, here and there, we will do it. That's all there is to it. We will do it. Okay, there's a red tree down there, but there's a very high probability that something nasty is going to spawn if we go down yes. that way. Medical assistance immediately. Okay, so yeah, let's go. Let's just go get these, and then we'll go around that direction on the way back. Okay. All right. I'm just going to sit here and whack on this tree until we get our health all the way back, and then I have a few extra berries to spare. Okay. Our knife is completely broken. Uh, so now it's taken like twice as many hits to harvest a berry from the tree. Uh, pick it up. There we go. And it's going to take a million hits to kill this guy now, too. Okay, so um, we're going to put this away for now. 
Uh, we're going to stop over at this purple tree because we need to uh, make some makeshift tape so that we... Oh, wait, that's not a purple tree. That's a bark tree. Damn it. Damn it, Jim. All right, now we're going to have to deal with this oversized tick. That's what they look like. Except for they only have four legs instead of six. Yeah, um, early game survi survival is way harder now than it was before. And I love it. I absolutely love it. Okay. So, we're going to go back down to this blue tree. Hopefully, uh, got to watch out for the spider. Uh, hopefully, there's a few more berries left in there. There should be, because I don't think I harvested the whole thing. I don't remember how many... Shit. How many berries we need to make. Uh, or we need for the tape. How many tapes we need to make. Ah! Uh, damn it! Well, at least if he kills us now, we have a... We have a spawn point. We're gonna probably... If we can get away from him, we're gonna have to just use the same tactic. Now, actually, you know, if we get... Oh, shit! Out of stamina! If we get, uh... In our shack, I wonder if he'll bugger off then. I don't know if he will or not. Let's see if we can get him kind of caught up on this ledge here. Okay. Okay. So it looks like maybe... They fixed it so the bugs can't come through your structures. Is he he leaving? Yeah, he's leaving. Okay. Whew. Yeah, you go away. You go away. All right. Um, let's look at this again. Uh, utilities. That only requires one thing of tape. Oh, sh uh, makeshift cloth bundle. Okay. Here we go. Okay, now we can make one of these. And now we can make one of these, finally. Okay, I think the crap's gone. Whew! Okay, so... Um... Let's do, like, a row of storage along here. We've got to, we've got to lighten up, because we're just so heavy right now. Um, so we're going to put it... Right there. Okay. Finally. Finally making some progress here. All right, let's open this up. We don't have a lot of, of room here, but uh, let's drink that. We got to... I, I wish I wish we could tell the way... Oh, I guess we could see weight down here, right? Okay, so is it sorted by weight? No, it can't be. That's only 0.1 kilogram. That's okay. So what's the heaviest thing? This is two kilograms. We don't need to carry two pistols with us. Uh, this is two kilograms. That's three and a half kilograms. Damn. Vitals dropping. Okay, we can put that down there, and those can go there. This is 0.1 uh, or yeah, 0.1 kilograms. These actually aren't as heavy as you'd think. That's a half a kilogram. That's 0.4. That's 0.2. Oh, that's 8.8. .8. Crap. Okay. Yeah. Let's get rid of that. Um, but this is a this is scrap cloth versus cloth bundle, which is also two kilograms. So let's put that in there. I think I'm gonna drop all of this stuff for now. Well, maybe we shouldn't though, because we might need it to craft stuff. Okay. This is 25 kilograms. Yowzers. All right, so we got the heaviest stuff out of our inventory. We're down to 37.8% weight, which is much, much more manageable. Uh, we are protected from the dust storm, or we would have been taking damage now. Um, let's... I, I'm not sure if we're going to need this or not, so let's pick it back up for now. And let's do a save point here. And then we're going to have to wait out the storm, and then we're going to have to figure out what our next move is. I think our next move, actually, we might as well talk about it now while we're sitting here. I think we're going to probably want to 
the mission thing wants us to build a furnace. But I'm wondering if we should maybe do a workbench first because then we can make a new melee tool. Um, because our, ha our our hammer, our our knife is completely ruined. It's just destroyed. So I think this is our next highest priority, which means we need to get uh, we make bloop, we need to make three more uh, makeshift patch tapes. Uh, so we need purple tree for that. Um, and we have one just down at the bottom of the hill. So yeah, uh, we need this to make the the table. So let's grab that, and then we're gonna need this to make some of this stuff. I'm thinking we need this for mining. Uh, so let's grab that, and then we're going to have to get that to go down into this tree. Normally I would go pistols, but... See, the thing is, is... What do we... I wonder what we need to make this. I, I know you can't make this in the in the table here. Because when I, when I logged in for just a little bit before I started over, I noticed that you couldn't do that. Uh, I do want this, though, assuming it's still as badass as it was before. The pr question is, is that the priority or not? Uh, not really sure. You know what? I'm, I think I'm going to sit on engineering points for the moment. Uh, for science, we're going to want to get to the printer. We're going to need that for sure. So let's just grab it now. And we'll get the, we'll get the Kim station and the printer. And then let's go here and get to the ammo since we have a pistol so we can make that as soon as possible okay i think that's a good way to spend the points oh no we have wow we have 20 more combat points we know for sure that we want to go here but the thing is is the machete's not too bad of a melee tool and i don't know how soon we're gonna be able to get to this hmm decision decisions you know what? let's let's do let's go this route okay because, you know, we'll eventually get all the points we need anyway, so it's not not that big of a deal. All right. So we're starving once again. Let's go here and eat. Two, three. We'll eat half of those. And that just about got us all the way back up. And uh, let's drink. Oh, I guess we don't need to. And then we'll save another thing. Okay, we got to go get some purple berries. So we got a purple tree here. Uh, we need, I think we needed to make three tapes. Okay, uh, we got three berries. No, wait, I was going to say, I think we got a few more than that. I, I did some extra ones because we're probably going to need more of these even after we make the workbench is my guess. Is it just me or did, did they actually make it so... You can see the berries in the blue grass better. I don't know. Not really sure. Okay. Um, let's get back up here. Okay. Time to build the workbench. So, to do that, we need uh, three makeshift patch tapes. Oh, and we need to make three of these. Okay, and then we need some uh, scrap. Space debris, scrap hinge, I guess that's considered scrap, right? I hope. Two utilities. Scrap metal. Okay. Uh, all right, let's turn this this way. All right, man. They changed the way this looked, too. That Osiris thing wasn't there in the back before. Uh, get rid of that. Okay. All right. Now, let's see. What do we need here? Oh, we can make wire in here. Nice. I always thought it was a little bit weird that we had to do the... the Wait for the fabricator to make wire. Um, wow, we can even make circuit boards in here. Interesting. So, what we want, probably, well, we need a weapon, um, but we also can make the makeshift chisel, leather, alien hide. Okay, uh, 
The crude metal blade just requires scrap. Oh, you son of a... This is not the time for you to be showing up, you bastard. Alright, we got alien tissue off of him. Alright, so, um, let's get back in here. A crude metal shovel, a crude metal sword, which requir re requires the blade. Uh, so all of this, it looks like all of these weapons need... Oh, did I want to make that? I guess I did. All of these weapons require these leather, uh, or leather, and we haven't come across any alien hide, so... Yeah, we're going to have to go kill some stuff, but how do we do that? Oh, no, 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 no. Don't make another one of those. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Talk about landing right in your front yard, man. Um, okay. We have no way to mine this yet. So here, okay, here's what we got to do. Um... We got a problem. That problem is, in order for me to make any kind of a weapon, uh, whether that be the crude metal sword, we need we need leather straps, and to get leather straps, we need leather or alien hide. Uh, no. So how do we how do we get a weapon? Can we make... Okay, we, we just made the axe head. Yeah, see, that needs leather straps, too. Um... Guys, we might be in trouble here. All right, let's go out this way. There's some more stuff. Maybe we'll luck out and be able to loot some alien hide. I doubt it, though. Or maybe we, we'll luck out and we'll be able to loot some cartridges for our pistol. But nonetheless, let's go this way. And see what we can see. There does seem to be a lot more POIs and stuff, you know, that you can salvage, which is good. This is a nice wide open space for a base. Uh, this isn't like the Phoenix base place, is it? Oh, maybe it is. I don't know. Oh, crap. There's a crab. Of course there is. Why should we have expected anything less than that? Maybe he'll bugger off. Oh, uh, he heard us. Okay. Well, all right. Here's what we're going to do. Can he get to us? We might be we might be safe here. Um, okay, so if we don't loot, can we open it up again? Okay, we can. All right, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to pick and choose what we're going to loot out of here. What is that? A fuel cell. How heavy is it? It's uh, one-tenth of a kilogram. Okay, we're going to take it. Uh, I'm going to leave this stuff behind for now we're only going to take stuff that is going to be useful to us here and now it's very generous of the game to give us access to pistol early on but it's completely useless without any ammo okay, we're going to take all this stuff I'm going to leave all of that uh, we'll take the wire and we're going to leave that Okay, so the crab doesn't seem to be able to get to us. Wire in that. Come on, please give me a pistol cell. Please, game. Pretty please. Well, we're getting lots of bandages, so I can't complain about that, man. Another, another thing. Um, it looks like it does have a durability, but... We haven't really lost any durability. How heavy is this? It's two kilograms. 
Well, let's take it for now. There's a lot of stuff to loot here. Okay, let's um, let's run over here. Or no, actually, we'll run under this one. I think these crates should have a chance of pistol ammo, and maybe they do, and we've just been extremely unlucky. And I think they should have food in them. Uh, or maybe the chance to loot a melee a melee weapon, right? I wouldn't mind trying to kill that Minotaur, but not with a crab around. Not with Mr. Krabs around. Okay, let's run off this way. There's a, some rubber. Okay, well, this is all useful for sure, but I don't think we're going to find alien animal critter hide in these chests. And that's what we need. We, need either, we either need to find that or we need to find an actual melee tool. Do we look in here? Yeah. So, yeah, I, I think it's probably not really worth to conti continue looking in this stuff for now. But, man, there is a lot of loot here. Goodness. A lot of loot. Okay, well, um, we're probably going to have to make a run for it. We need to find small critters to fight and hope that they end up dropping stuff. Oh man, I'd like to actually see if we could harvest that red tree. It's pretty close to Mr. Krabs though, so probably not going to work. All right, let's go this way. Wait a minute, can you... Okay, hold on. Let's look at something again. Craft. Oh. Utilities. No, it looks like we need the table. Oh, oh! Oh! Dudes! We can make weapons. I, I was looking in the table. I wasn't looking at my own thing. Oh, okay. You guys are probably like going, Old guy, look at your inventory! Oh, okay. We're not as in bad shape as I thought we were. We are not in as bad a shape as I thought we were. Okay, let's go back. I'm glad I looked in there. <laughs> I was just thinking I should look at my inventory to see if... um. We can craft leather from these parts, and then I just realized that. Okay. Oh, uh, that's a relief. Sorry it took me so long to figure that out, you guys. But hey, you know, better late than never, right? Better late than never. Okay. I, I, I thought that was just a little weird that we we were backed up against the wall there, you know, but we weren't. It was just me not getting the, the full picture. Okay, so let's go back to here. We're going to have to put up with my dude going uh, 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 a little bit longer. Um, so did we make a crude metal blade? All right. So I don't think we can actually use these right now. Yeah. I don't think we can use any of that. So um, let's go here. So to make a stone blade, we need two rocks. Uh, well, is that what we want though? Or do we want to make the scythe? Because I'm, I have a feeling. Okay, this does 15 damage plus or minus 10 plus 75 percent critical hit. No shit. What does this? What does this do? That does damage eight plus or minus four and 75 percent critical hit. What's this do? Nine and seven and 75. This seems like the best weapon, man. And I'm guessing we can mine with it too, because it sort of kind of looks like a pick. What does this do? A makeshift multi-tool faster from a tough piece of chitinous antenna to allow for repairing zone. Oh, that's cool. Okay. Um, yeah, let's make this. So we just need to make two of these. Uh, so we need two of these. 
Vitals are now critical. Oh, yeah, I know, I know. We need what, two of those? Okay, so let's make two of these. And let's make ourselves a crap size. Oh, we're saved. <laughs> we're saved. Um, That stone shovel does not look like a stone shovel. It looks like an aluminum shovel. Okay. Now we're back in business. Now we're freaking back in business. I hope we can mine with this, too. All right. Can we? Oh, no, we can't. This mineral is too hard to harvest with this item. Okay. Um... How hard is it? It is... It doesn't tell us. See, I kind of miss the, the tool tips. Crab scythe. Made the weapon from the talent of a crab monster. Um, if we... Yeah, there's no more... There's no more tool tip, so it doesn't actually tell us how hard it is. Does it tell us that here? Yeah. Oh, hardness zero. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. So we can't mine with this at all. Can we mine with this? That's hardness 0.5. And this is hardness 0.5. So yeah, it looks like we can only use this as a weapon. Huh. All right. I wonder if we should make the axe for harvesting trees. Um. So, you know, the, so we save the durability on there. Okay. Yeah. Let's grab three rocks. Oh, shit. We're almost dead. Okay, we're back to full health. Uh, oh, we're out of water, too. Uh, let's drink. Okay. Are we good? Yeah. Okay, let's pick up... Uh, there was some... Where were those stones that we saw? Over here? Yeah. Well, they've certainly brought back the meteorites. Bad that didn't hit Mr. Krabs in the head and take him out. Okay, that is that all the stone? Oh, there's some right right here too. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is go here. We're gonna craft a stone axe head. Okay. And then we just need to make two more things of tape. And here, and here, and a stone axe. Ugh. Very good. Okay, so the axe we're going to use uh, for harvesting trees. And this we'll use for combat. So that way we can save the durability on it. Now, the axe does have a 0.5 hardness. Oh, okay, it does tell us that down here. Interesting. So if we come across like a, a mineral deposit thing that has... Um, you know, this 0.5 hardness, I don't know if there is anything like that, but if we do, then we'll be able to make that work. Okay. So now we're back in business, man. Now we can fight. Um, we're going to go back to this red tree and see if we can get, no, that's a, that's a purple tree. Red. Oh, the red trees are up on that hill. I don't know if I want to take the crab on yet though. But this thing has 75% critical hit. That's uh, that's impressive. I'm just going to throw that out there, man. That is impressive. Okay, let's go up this hill. All right, I don't think we finished this tree out here, so. Much better. Okay, no more viable resources. Hey, but that's a nice little collection of food there. Okay, we'll eat half of those. We'll save the other half. How's our weight? We're at 73%, so we're getting heavy. Uh, we need to make another... Is this thing reset, too? Let's take a look. It's either a reset or we never actually completely finished it. What is the next thing we need to do? I probably need to start working on a furnace, so let's take a look and see what do we need for that. Uh, I think we actually have everything for this. Uh, we need a couple more purple things. Oh, let's look at our... Uh, let's look at this. 
Uh, we have one thing. Uh, so I'm going to just put that into health right now. And I'm not too worried about skill points at the moment. Okay, so yeah, this is a this is our harvesting tool. The durability has gone down really fast on it, but that doesn't surprise me. How do we repair this? Is this something we can repair in our inventory, or do we just have to make a new one? Uh, let's look at it. Stone axe, melee. If we right click, unequip, or drop, if we put it in here. Is there an option to repair? Nope, I think we just have to make a new one. Hmm, okay. If that's the way it is, then that's the way it is. Should we try and see if we can kill Mr. Krabs with our scythe? With that 75% critical hit, we could potentially do a number on him, and he might give us some hide, too. Okay, here, let's save. And let's go... Mix it up with Mr. Krabs here. And then we're going to stop and grab some more purple berries so that we can make the furnace. Okay, here we go. Let's see how well we do here. Oh, look at that. Holy crap. We just got a crit. Oh, nice. <laughs> I love it. Okay, so he's got different harvestable parts. So, talon harvest. Okay, we got alien tissue, head harvest. Alien tissue. Uh, what else? Talon harvest. Oh, I love this, you guys. This is awesome. So, you, you can harvest, like, different parts of him. Body harvest. Where the hell do we get uh, the leather from if the crabs don't drop it? Who the hell drops it? Leg harvest. The bad news, though, is our, that used up half of <laughs> the durability of the pick. Oh, well. It is what it is, right? Crab sheddings. I'm picking all this stuff up because, you know, who knows how... One of the things I'm noticing is that some of the real early game stuff is all of a sudden a lot more useful than it used to be, you know? Uh, all right, let's use this for here. And we'll just, we need the plant fiber stuff for crafting. Pick that up. Center fern, center fern. And branches. Okay, let's get some more purple berries so that we can make our furnace and hopefully another container too to store some stuff because we're starting to get heavy again. And we got, oh, it's a rock outcropping. Oh! That is awesome, guys. Now we can actually mine rocks instead of just finding a few here and there. That is really good. Love it. Okay, let's go back here. Yeah, we're not getting that one. <laughs> this one, like, landed... Oh, man. Like, right there, but it's inside the rock. Okay, um, yeah. Changes. The changes they have made are really, really good overall. Really good. Okay, let's go to here. And to make the furnace, we need two things of makeshift patch tape. So let's make a couple of these. A couple of these. And then we also need a barrel and scrap pipe. Uh, wait a minute. I thought, didn't we have some pipes in our inventory? Oh, that's a hose. Crude pipe. What is this? Oh, that's hose. I thought that was a pipe. Okay. So, to make the pipe, we need two things of scrap metal. All right. So, let's grab this. We'll make two pipes. Oh, they don't stack. Okay. All right, so we got that done. Now, what else do we need? Utilities and just one barrel. And we have some barrels in here. And here we go. Well, let's put the furnace right here. We're just going to kind of use our equipment to establish a perimeter for us for now. 
And uh, so F2, utilities and furnace. There we go. Um, let's turn it this way, I guess. All right, look at that, you guys. We finally got a furnace. Okay, what can we do with this right at the moment? Not a damn thing. Now, here's some interesting things about the furnace now. First of all, it takes fuel. Um, first, I, I, I'm not even sure what kind of fuel we use, so I guess we'll figure that out. And you can upgrade it. Wait a minute. What? What? What the hell? Oh, there we go. Okay. So it takes it takes fuel, but um, I don't. I don't know what. I thought I heard some footsteps. I don't know what kind of fuel it takes. It doesn't tell us. Um, but look at this. We now make actual alloys instead of just straight up stuff, which is really cool. Nickel and carbon. Uh, and we can make rubber and plastic in here now, so we don't need the Kim bench for that. But this is the really cool part. Check this out. You can upgrade it. And then it'll actually start making water. So can we make one more thing of tape? I think we can. Here, watch this. So if we go um, F2, make one more thing of tape here. Okay. And then grab one of the extra jars that we have. Um, well, I guess we have those already in our inventory. So if we go here and we hit upgrade, we can make the precipitation collector upgrade. <gasps> F2. Wait, what? How do we left mouse button build? Wait a minute, what? Oh yeah, we okay, so we need our our tool. So this is basically what I think this is, okay? Is I think this is basically the water collector that we had before and it's just going to happen uh it's just going to happen over time, right? Wait, extract methane? Oh, wait a minute. So is methane the fuel that this requires to run on? I'll bet you that's how it works. So that actually isn't a water thing. All right, well, let's... Here, let me show you something else then. I'm loving this, man. This is so much better. Phoenix Fire, you guys are doing an awesome job. Awesome job. Okay, so we also have a water distillery upgrade. So this must be... Yeah, this must be the, the water thing. Um, there's a fuel cell upgrade, and there is a low heat upgrade. Allows uh, Upgrades the heating regulation of the furnace, allowing the boiling of water and it cooking of... Oh, yeah. Okay, so that's how we cook food now. All right, we can make this. We just need to make another crude pipe. So let's uh, come in here. Even though water's actually been a lot easier um, now than it was before because of the fact that you don't use as much as you did before. Okay, let's grab this. All right, and then get our little thingamadoodle out. Whoa! You son of a... Here, third person. You mess with the wrong old guy. I'm gonna kick the shit out of you, man. All right, so let's see. Head inspect. Minotaur. Okay, so we got some science. Whoops, science points. Come on, give us some leather, man. How the hell do we get leather? These guys are just giving alien tissue. Um. Okay, There was there another... Do they not sink it to the ground anymore? Here, let's do this in first person. That might be easier. Vitals dropping. We're taking nutrition damage. There we go. Alien tissue. Yeah, if he's got another, I I don't I think, I think they don't sink into the ground anymore. Yeah, that must be the case. Okay. Um, let's do this. Let's go here and. We'll eat five of these. And let's also drink some water. What's our what's which, boop, which one's our lowest one? Oh, this is. Hydration levels are now satisfied. Okay, so now if we get our our little buddy out here and we go um 
Oh no, we can't we can't have that out yet to get in here. Okay, so go to upgrade. Now we want to do a water distillery upgrade. Okay, and then we go back to three and we build it. Oh, this is so cool. I love it. All right, man. So that precipitation no wait, that's a top thing. Okay, let's get rid of this. How do we get to the water? Fuel input. Oh, okay, that's where we put fuel. Uh, that's the methane thing. Uh, all right. How do we get to the water? Um. Oh, do we still have to? Oh, okay. It looks like we still have to feed it oxy and nitrogen. You can do amounts of 10, 50, or 100. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so it doesn't just distill water out of the out of thin air. We have to actually feed it the gases now. Now that makes sense. I'm okay with that though because, like I said, I mean we're actually doing fine on hydration. Hydration was a lot more of an issue in the previous version than it is in here. Uh, it's food that we've actually had the most trouble with. But as soon as we can make this cooking thing, let's look at that again. Uh, upgrades. Okay, the low heat upgrade. Whoops. We need um. We need brass and zamok and gold. Okay, so next episode, we are going to go out and see if we can get this stuff. We we can only harvest 0.5 hardness nodes, but hopefully by doing that, we can get all of the stuff that we need to make brass, which is copper and zinc. Uh, zamok, which is zinc, magnesium, copper, and aluminum, and... Gold, straight up gold, I guess. Yeah. All right, guys, I am really enjoying this. This is great. Uh, I hope you guys are enjoying this too. And so, yeah, that is it for this episode. If you guys enjoyed this episode, please hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. If you have, thank you very much. I really appreciate it. Uh, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. We'll catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.